Good morning. Welcome to Three Quick Minutes with Pastor Billy. Uh, if you've got a Bible, let's look in Titus chapter 2, uh, beginning in verse 11. Titus chapter 2, beginning in verse 11. We're thinking about hope. We're continuing to set our mind on hope. And so look at what it says. Titus 2, beginning in verse 11. For the grace of God has appeared, bringing salvation for all people. So the grace of God has appeared, bringing salvation for all people. Uh, Hebrews 11.29 says, uh, calls the Holy Spirit the Spirit of grace. Now in that context, listen to what the grace of God does. Training us to renounce ungodliness and worldly passions and to live self-controlled, upright lives, upright and godly lives in the present age, waiting for the blessed hope, the appearing of the glory of our great God and Savior, Jesus Christ, who gave himself up for us to redeem us from all lawlessness and to purify for himself a people for his own possession who were zealous for good works. And so the grace of God has appeared um, and he's the one who is training us to renounce the things of this world and the worldly passions and to live self-controlled, upright, godly lives in this present age while we wait for the blessed hope, for the confident expectation of the return of Jesus Christ. Hey, let's pray this, uh, this passage of scripture right now. Father, we exalt you. We praise you for you are the spirit of grace. We praise you for your grace because we don't deserve it, God. We can't work for it. We can't work our ways into being holy and being righteous, God. We thank you for giving us that grace. We thank you for your son, Jesus who has redeemed us by His blood, who has set us free by His Spirit and His power, Lord. Uh, so God, we exalt You, Lord. Right now, we surrender to You that we might wait confidently for the blessed hope of the return of Christ. God, in that hope, would You help us to renounce ungodliness in this world? Would You help us to renounce, as He says, the worldly passions and and to live self-controlled and upright and godly lives in this present age help us to live self uh, help us to live upright and godly lives in our homes Lord God of righteousness God help us to to stir one another up toward love and good works here in our our home as we wait for the blessed hope of the return of Jesus Christ Father, would you fill us with your spirit of grace that we ourselves might show grace to those who are around us, Lord, that we might show the same grace that we ourselves have, have received. Help us to stand in your power, stand in your mercy, stand in your goodness, Lord, and not in our own. May your name be exalted. May you be blessed uh, for, from now until eternity. We love you, Lord Jesus, and it's in your name that we pray. Amen. Amen. Hey, God bless you. I pray that this has been a blessing for you. Uh, may we walk and may we live today with hope. Blessings. Bye-bye.